Number 15 for the Whalers with a great... Janine in the middle. Ferraro to Turgeon. He shoots safe. Jensen. Oh, oh, Janine with the puck right there. Now, this is where it happened. Yes, that is Duchesne. Wow, look at that. See, Deneen jumped up in the air, left his feet, and really caught Duchesne up high with the elbows and the shoulder. And later on, they came back together at center ice, and they both cooled it out for a couple of minutes. Big Sam Duchesne. Silkman was the one that cranked him. Here's the hit at center ice a moment ago. Everson charging into Francis Getty. Sticks, elbows, knees, everything flying on that one. And Kevin Collins right in the middle. Or rather, Danny McCourt was there first, and Sammy, then uh, Kevin Collins came over to help out. Turgeon got knocked down by Stevens and then got out. They're still uh, yapping at one another. Well, Turgeon's not the kind of guy that likes to go to the penalty box. Stevens is. He likes to mix it up quite a bit back there in the Washington defense. Turgeon may be lucky he fell down there and lost his footing as Stevens came across with that cross check up pretty high and then they mixed it up after the play. They both sit it out. Turgeon wants to play hockey. Right? Went down in the corner. Here comes the check. You see Adams try to go after Samuelson. Samuelson ducked underneath him. And we'll see what happens when we come back. The score, the Hartford Whalers three and Washington nothing. But he just had second effort. And Babbage picked it up. Babbage in front of the net. It's four nothing, Hartford Whalers. He has room and shoots. Save will you. And he holds it in the midsection. I may have heard him a little bit. Murphy with the shot down. He didn't see it will you. But he's in the carpenter. He shot it wide. He had a wide open net. They come back to win at 
Ryan Murray certainly upset with the way they played the first two periods, but has to be happy with the final result. Well, the Washington Capitals defeat the Hartford Whalers 5-4. We'll be back at the Hartford Civic Center in just a moment.